Microchips have significantly evolved over time, playing a crucial role in our technologically advanced world. Modern processors, the compact powerhouses that drive our world, can contain billions of transistors on a single chip. This is akin to a bustling city of electrons, all operating in unison to power your favorite devices. At the heart of this microscopic city is silicon, a remarkable element that functions as a semiconductor. It has the ability to either conduct or block electric currents depending on its configuration. Silicon is like the traffic officer of the electron world, directing traffic and maintaining order. The process of creating a silicon wafer, the foundation for our microchips, is no easy task. It mandates the creation of a flawless monocrystalline structure, implying a perfect uniform crystal structure throughout the entire silicon wafer. This complex process involves intricate steps such as cutting, polishing, and circuit design through computer-aided design software. It is analogous to the construction of a skyscraper, but on a nanoscale. The manufacturing process poses further challenges. We deal with minute transistors, about 200 times smaller than a red blood cell. Creating these transistors is like constructing a sandcastle with grains of sand so minuscule they are invisible to the naked eye. Adding to the complexity, photolithography machines play an indispensable role in imprinting billions of transistors on our silicon wafers. Engineers are continually finding innovative methods to enhance laser beam precision, such as intensifying the laser beam by passing it through a layer of water. The next time you use an electronic device, think of the microchip. These compact tech titans relentlessly toil away, right in the palm of your hand. Let's delve into the intricate world of transistors, the vital components of our digital age. These are elements 200 times smaller than a red blood cell, yet they serve as the fundamental building blocks of our digital systems. Manufacturing transistors is not a simple task. These minute entities are fabricated using photolithography, a sophisticated piece of equipment that could fit into a science fiction narrative. This machine functions like a high-tech printing press, but instead of printing words on paper, it's tasked with imprinting billions of transistors onto silicon wafers. However, the process is fraught with difficulties. When dealing with components of this scale, the smallest error can have catastrophic consequences. The analogy of painting the Mona Lisa on a grain of rice illustrates the degree of precision required. To enhance the accuracy of the laser beam used in this process, engineers have pioneered innovative strategies. One such technique includes passing the laser beam through a layer of water to increase the laser's intensity, thus enabling greater precision. Still, despite the water-assisted laser beams and advanced machinery, the process is far from infallible. It's a delicate balancing act of technology that demands attention to detail and precision. So when you immerse in an engaging video game, take a moment to appreciate the tiny transistors. Their size might be microscopic, but their influence on our world is vast. These tiny technological miracles are continuously working to store all your essential data and information. Therefore, it's crucial to recognize their importance and the intricate process that goes into their creation. Microchips are fundamental to the operation of our most intimate devices, from smartphones to laptops and gaming consoles. Their manufacturing process is a marvel of precision and cleanliness. The creation involves dealing with components as tiny as transistors, which are 200 times smaller than a red blood cell. Even the smallest speck of dust could potentially cause catastrophic damage. It's akin to attempting to paint the Mona Lisa, only for a rogue sneeze to send your brushstroke wildly off course. To mitigate this, microchip manufacturing takes place in specialized environments known as clean rooms. These clean rooms maintain air quality that is 10,000 times cleaner than the air we breathe outside. They serve as sanctuaries for microchips, allowing them to develop without fear of contamination from the outside world. The engineers in these environments wear protective suits. Far from a fashion statement, these outfits are vital for preventing human contaminants like hair and skin from interfering with the manufacturing process. In essence, they serve as superhero costumes for microchip engineers, equipping them with the means to combat the invisible enemies of dust and debris. This meticulous process ensures the precision and perfection of our tech devices. The microchips that power the devices we hold in our hands are born in environments that are cleaner than hospital operating rooms. The next time you power up your device, take a moment to appreciate the journey its microchips have been through. From their birth in immaculate clean rooms to their final destination in your hands, they are the product of a process that is as rigorous and demanding as any the modern world has seen. The role of copper in microchip manufacturing is not commonly understood, yet it is absolutely pivotal. 
Copper, the same material that is found in everyday coins, is important to this high-tech process. Microchips essentially function as miniature cities, home to billions of transistors, each needing communication pathways. Copper provides these pathways, creating interconnecting wires that form a complex web linking every part of the chip. However, before copper can perform its role, a barrier layer is applied. This layer acts as a safeguard, ensuring that the copper remains in its designated location, akin to a microscopic traffic regulator. The barrier is established, trenches are filled with copper. This process is not as simple as it appears, it requires meticulous attention to detail, as any excess copper must be ground down to ensure a perfect copper. Therefore it's not just a component of coins, it is an essential component in the world of microchip manufacturing. From mere grains of sand the microchip embarks on an extraordinary journey, ultimately becoming the core component of your favorite technology device. Silicon, the primary constituent of sand, undergoes meticulous transformation into a flawless monocrystalline structure. Following a rigorous process of cutting, polishing and computer-aided design, we approach the final steps of the intricate process. This is where chip encapsulation comes into play, the process of securing the chip onto a frame. A combination of tin and silver grains are delicately applied to form a bond between the chip and its metallic framework. This process closely resembles crafting a sandwich, but in this instance the outcome powers your smartphone, not your lunch break. The process concludes with the transformation of silicon into a high-tech circuit board, signifying a remarkable journey from beach to motherboard. The microchip, once a simple grain of sand is now at the heart of your latest tech device.